Mural may sound hard to believe and it does sound tricky, but in some cases these crooks are in fact stealing a person's identity. How do they do it? Well, it starts by grabbing a picture of that person. They can then manipulate the video and sound and impersonate that person on a remote job interview. Deepfake videos can be misinformation super spreaders. The Ukrainians. Шановні захисники. Take this heavily manipulated fake video from March depicting Ukrainian President Zelensky appearing to tell Ukrainians to surrender. This video, a deep fake. Now, a new warning from the FBI telling job recruiters to beware. You no longer need to hack the company. You're being offered a way in by faking your way in. The FBI Internet Crime Complaint Center already seen an increase in reports of deep fake videos and stolen personal ID information to apply for remote work. Applicants are able to use this. They can get hired pretending to be someone else. And all of a sudden you have an insider who's been given access to data within a company and that person can just steal that data. Deep fakes include a video, an image or recording altered and manipulated to misrepresent someone saying or doing something they didn't say or do. In 2018, Senator Marco Rubio of Florida warned these videos could disrupt elections. The vast majority of people watching that image on television are going to believe it. And if that happens two days before an election or the night before an election, it could influence the outcome of your race. There are many ways to spot a deep fake video. The lips and words may not sync up. You can tell with the video of President Zelensky, the head and body don't match. It's also good always to do a background check and to confirm maybe that email addresses match up with what you know about this individual or contact information matches up. Now, the FBI is warning that these fake job applicants are targeting jobs in IT, computer programming, and related fields where often hires can be made without ever meeting the applicant in person. Muriel?